going on YouTube? I'm finally back. I haven't uh, posted a, a vlog in a long time because you know with this pandemic shit and lockdown so it's nice to be back. So this time I'm gonna do a mini review on a famous beach called Crystal Beach. So I'm here with my buddy Gary. Hey! Who's been here a few times, right? Yeah, about three. And this is this my is first fourth. time. So fourth for him and first yeah. for me. So what do you have to say about this? Beautiful beach, nice crystal clear water. Uh, it's warm out there actually, and it's crowded, but it's not bad. Yeah, like you know, there's some people around, but it's good, good vibe. They say. Awesome. So mm -hmm. he uh, he invited me and Tina as well to mm -hmm. come and join, and so why not? I love the beach, you know. I like to go on holidays. You like being on a holiday, really. Yes, exactly. So I'm gonna show you more of the beach and see if you feel the same way as we do. So uh, we'll be back. Beautiful day here at Crystal Beach and people are just out and playing and just doing all kinds of fun things. So uh, let's take a look at the beach. It's fully packed. Everyone's enjoying. Everyone's out. So pretty much in Canada, um, we are pretty much back to normal. Um, everyone's out, no more masks, no more lockdowns, and hopefully that stays like that. So it's beautiful. The water's clear, as you can see. It's not blue like, you know, in Cuba or Mexico or Dominican Republic or Hawaii, but you know, this is Canada. And we just gotta appreciate what we have here. Pretty amazing, look at that. So Crystal Beach in Fort Erie. This is my first time here at Crystal Beach in Fort Erie. And yes, we do have beautiful beaches in Canada. And this is just to show you that we do. The view is beautiful, the water is warm. And it's pretty clear. See, it's pretty clear. Even though it's not blue, aqua blue, but it's it's good. You know, have to appreciate what we have. So Canada, we love the beaches here. So I believe those houses down there, uh, you can either rent them or someone owns them. But imagine having your own place, and you got the ocean view. Pretty amazing. So I love the beach. This is what I like to do on my summer days. So uh, the little a little uh, a disadvantage about this is that you do have to pay uh, ten dollars per person to get in here, and you gotta pay for parking. So I put fifteen dollars for the day. So, but you know what, it's, it's, it's worth it because they keep the, the beach clean and and they have like washrooms and change rooms, so it's pretty cool. So we're about to finish the day. Yeah. Just a quick review on uh, 
Crystal Beach, and uh, what do you have to say? Perfect, 100%, 10 out of 10, anytime. Yes, so uh, if anyone's trying to search for, in YouTube, you know, about Crystal Beach, so here's an idea of what it's all about. So uh, yeah, come, try it out. Crystal Definitely Beach. enjoy it. Check it out. Beautiful, look at all these floors around me. Like we're on vacation. That's right. Vacation that we don't have to take the plane, right? Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Check out these uh, flamingos. Really cool. First time here, so I do recommend it. Um, of all the beaches that I've been through, um, this is probably one of the best ones. Um, so compared to Wasaga Beach, Saba Beach, Grand Bend, Port Dover, uh, Port Corbin, uh, this is one of the one of the best ones I like. Uh, it's, it's, it gets crowded, full of energy, and you know, party, drinks. Although you can have alcohol in here. So that's the one thing that uh, I noticed. So no alcohol. And there's a fee to get in. It's $10 and $15 for the parking. So that's the downside. But overall, it's worth it just for the day. So Crystal Beach in Fort Erie. I suggest you come now. All right, see you soon. Okay, so that's it. And until my next vlog, subscribe and hit that button. Zoom.